Hello there guys! For today's video, I'm going to show you how to join multiple people in one image in Photoshop Beta. And also, we will dive deeper into using of object selection tool, free transform, select all, generative fill with a partner model, Gemini Tree, Nano Banana. Now let's get started. Well, I have here four images that we will be using. So one is this woman, this man, this girl and this boy and we're going to join them into one photo turning them into a family even though it's not so the first step we're going to do is we're going to create our file where we are going to combine all these images together so going on to the toolbar go to file then choose on new i'm going to set the width to 190 pixels with a height of 1080p Right, then resolution is 150 pixels per inches. Then hit create. Now this one will create a landscape image size. Okay, now let's drag all those images here. So let's start here. We can do it this way. Press controller command plus A to select all. Press controller command plus C to copy. Let's go here on original document. Press controller command plus V. Okay, now we just have to rescale this one. So press Ctrl Command plus T for the transformation, then click and drag those points to decrease the scale of this image. All right, let's set this one to this, but make sure that you have more spacing on the other images. All right, well, this one is okay. Then hit enter. Now let's go into the other file. Same thing, press Ctrl Command plus A to select all, press Ctrl Command plus C to copy. Let's go here. Press controller command plus V. Press controller command plus T for the transformation. Click and drag these points in. Let's rescale and put it on. All right. Now let's go into the other same thing that I'm going to do. All right. So this one is fine now. Then hit enter. And by the way, if you find this video helpful so far, Please consider subscribing to help YouTube algorithm show my videos to other nerds like us. Now we already put all those documents in this image. So this time we're going to make use of the generative fill. But we have before we do that, we have to select all. So press controller command plus A to select all. Then go to the context or taskbar. Then you can find here generative fill. Or you can also go to the menu bar, go to edit, then choose on generative fill so i have here a generative fill window now we're going to type down here our prompt all right so here's the prompt that i use combine all selected people into a single studio portrait place them naturally as they are post in studio add studio lighting clean shadows and consistent color tones remove any backgrounds from the original images and replace it with smooth studio backdrop make it look like real professional studio photo shoot all right so i'm going to use this prompt by the way i'm also going to type this one on our description box below this video okay so once we're good with our prompt let's go and click on this icon so we have here a new feature of a partner model so let's go down here we have here the gemini tree with nano banana pro all right interesting recently we we're just using the gemini 2.5 but now we have this gemini tree so let's see how this one works so it's also preserved details while editing so click on that then once also set let's go and click generate after waiting for a few seconds here we go all right so all of our subjects are here yes this woman the man this girl and this boy preserving those faces and not only that also with their costumes well you can go to the properties panel and click generate again if you're not satisfied because gemini tree with nano banana pro only provides this one a single variation and here's the second variation so this one is not that bad let's zoom in actually so here's the first variation here's the second variation and if you're not yet satisfied, just keep on generating more images. Well, 
In our case, I'll still be choosing the first variation. And that's how it goes. So this, this one is the before, and this one is the after. And that is how to join multiple people in one image in Photoshop Beta.